Hey plant friends, it's that time again! We are going to another nursery today and I'm super excited because how did I find out about this place? I'm going to show you right now. I'm here at a water store okay, called Waterland in Santa Ana and it just so happens to be a hidden plant shop. And look, you guys, I cannot believe, look at all the selection. can't tell you how excited I am. I'm, uh, I didn't know this place existed. I did not know. And as soon as I saw that Instagram story, I'm like, I lost it. I had to go. It is over one hour away from my house and it's 1020, they open at 10. So we probably get there almost 1130. That's funny. I'm still, I'm just so excited. I don't even care how far it is. And I'm gonna bring you guys along with me. Guys, we're finally here. And the place is right behind me. It's called Waterland. And it says purified water and ice. That's the only thing. That's the only thing outside. It did not say anything about plants. So I'm so sure it's a hidden gem. So we are going to go inside. I'm so excited, I can't. Okay, let's go. I think this is a red tail. The cacti, this guy's 15. And this giant begonia angel wing. This guy is 42. And some strings of hearts. This guy is 25. You got some long strings down here. Here is a marble queen pothos. This guy is 22. This is a monstera deliciosa. This guy is 25. We have some ZZ over here. This guy is 25. Okay, and of course, the good old classic money plant, the Pilea. This guy is 35. And you have some uh, Begonia Angel Wing back here. There are 22 each. This is a variegated Irisen. Oh, we have a red one at home. We do? Yeah, Johnny sent that to us. So this guy is 10, it's pink stem, the one I have is red. Philodendra amroid, this guy is 25. And then there's a medium sized monstera, it's 38. This whole wall is just purified water. And then you have the plants on the side, it, which makes it perfect, you know, living condition for these tropical plants because they love, love humidity. So it's like perfect place for them. Oh my God, this is a Philodendron glory awesome. This guy is 99. We have one at home, babe. You remember? We, we have a small oh, yeah, one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Just one leaf, right? Uh, one and a baby one. Okay. This guy is 99. Oh, so cute. I swear I've never seen a Glory Awesome in any nursery in Los Angeles. This is the first time. Okay, so there's another Therium Plomani. And this guy is 75. I can't. Here is Monstera Deliciosa Thai Constellation. This is a variegated Monstera. This guy is 275. <gasps> Look at how gorgeous she is. Oh, yeah, look at here, there's a baby on the way. So you're getting two and a half leaves. This guy is so gorgeous. This one has like three leaves, and this guy is 255. And here is a smaller one. Let's see how much this small one is. This guy is 95. 
It's super cute. You already have a fenestration on this one. Another small one over here. This guy is 120. This guy has four leaves. And here is a Hoya. I don't know how to say the name, but this is common name is the Hoya fishtail. Wow. This one has one, two, three, four, five notes. And this guy is selling for 60. Oh my gosh, super, super cute. So she has four of them left. I've never seen a Hoya fish doll in person. This is the first time. Again, like the second I walk into this shop, I'm like, oh, mind blowing because there's so many things I've never seen in real life. Just seen pictures on Instagram. And this one is a Philodendron pink princess. This guy is 120. Oh, super gorgeous. This leaf is half pink half green and then the rest of the leaf have some like random pink speckles big guy is 300 has four leaves and every single leaf has like perfect fenestration and here we have three hoya linearies this guy is 60 was that kind of like normal price. That's what everybody's selling it for. And this is also sexy. These guys are pretty long. They're very rare. That's why they're so expensive. Wow. So cute. And we have some uh, Anthurium Clarinervium. This guy has four gorgeous leaves, very mature leaves. This guy is 110, that's not bad. The one I have is like tiny, you guys seen my unboxing video. That tiny little one was 55. So twice the amount of money and four times the size of the leaf, I think it's worth it. It's super cute. Oh my God, is this a dream? <laughs> in the middle of the nowhere in a water purifying shop then we have all these crazy plants I'm thinking this might be the owner the owner is not in the shop at the moment but I'm thinking maybe this is her own collection that she is selling but yeah all the plants look super healthy I'm so impressed and this is just a small little ficus larata so she's got two uh, Anthurium clarinervium over here. This guy is 100 with three leaves. This guy has four leaves and is 110. So for sure this guy is a winner <laughs> for an extra leaf. And we have some more um, Thai constellation monstera down here. This guy is 85. Oh, so cute. And this guy is 120. There is one new leaf on the way, and there's another one. This guy kind of get beat up, but still, you know, super cute. And I know so many people are looking for Vichy Eye since I purchased it from Anansi Tropical. And here they have it here. It's only 32. I bought mine for 29 from Anansi Tropical. And this guy is very cute. And the price is about um, average. Oh my god. Again, I've never seen a, a Clefia or Refolia in person. This is a first time. So this guy is... Oh, not for sale. Duh. <laughs> this guy is so rare. It's crazy. It's very gorgeous to see it in person. Um, and again, Clefia is a super fuzzy plant. So like I know a lot of people have brown edges on their clathium, which is kind of just like, you know, normal clathia or nata. This guy is 18. These guys are so popular right now. I see them literally everywhere in every nursery. And also like people have been posting pictures like crazy on Instagram. And here is a little pink princess. 
uh, Syngonium, these, are, these guys are super easy to care for and they're pretty common now too. Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! Okay, I have to talk about this one first. This is a, um, the philodendron plum... Shh. What's the name again? Plumani? Sorry, I f the name just escaped me. I can't think of the name now. I'll link it down below here. But, oh my gosh, this is one of the super rare philodendrons as well. This guy kind of got beat up a little bit. But still, you have a new baby on the way. And, oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, she is so gorgeous. This guy is 45. I'll say that's a... Um, that's a good price. That's not that's not bad at all. Consider how rare they are, you know. And this is a variegated alocasia. This guy is 45. It's just one single leaf. But this one single leaf is just stunning because half of the leaf is completely white and the other half if it's um uh, kind of like variegated. Oh, it's so pretty. My god, am I in the twilight zone? Like, I've been going to so many nurseries in Los Angeles and what a hidden gem I've found. And this is also a alocasia. This guy is 25. And there's a baby one. <laughs> this guy is 15. Ooh. Okay, so this is a healthier version of this guy. This guy was 45 and this is 60. Oh, this is so gorgeous. So this type of philodendron, they're not climbing type. They don't like to climb on the trees. They like to kind of like creep on the ground. So they don't usually, if you give them a pole, they wouldn't just climb automatically. So you kind of like have to give them support if you want them to you know, go up because their habits are kind of like creeping on the ground. But this guy is 60. 60. Oh my gosh. Like honestly, if we have to, we want plants like this, we either have to order online from Florida or from Thailand or you just don't see them. And I'm just so surprised to see this guy here. I'm considering it. Look what else I found! This is a philodendron ring of fire. This guy is 100. So cute. This guy is variegated. It's beautiful. I've seen them for selling for um, between 75 to 150. So the price varies. And so this price is about medium. Um, not too high, not too low. I'm still so obsessed over this. Wait a second. Oh my gosh. I think this is Alocasia Caprea. I've never touched one in person. <laughs> I've no this is a crazy. I've seen we've seen one in um, Arcadia Arboretum, remember? Mm. In the greenhouse. Okay. There were like three or four of them, like next to the waterfall because they love humidity. And oh my gosh, look at this gorgeous. Just chilling over here on the counter. This guy is 150, of course. This guy is so gorgeous. Beautiful. I would love to own one, but I, I would hate myself so much if I killed it. And here are some spider plants, and um, here's some lipstick plant, and here's another one. This is another Alocasia Caprea. This guy is 140 so $10 cheaper than this one. I think it's just the leaf size. This guy is obviously smaller. So cute though. And here are some uh, philodendron mecans. This guy is 22. Very cute. She has like two of them. And here are just some uh, uh, ficus lorata for 22. That's that's pretty much everything. And you have some not for sale 
satin polos on both sides. They are very long and beautiful. And I think what I really wanted from this shop is number one is definitely the fellow dungeon glory awesome. You can just never have too much of them. <laughs> right, babe? I love it. And the second one I'm obsessed with is for sure this giant variegated monstera. And here are some fishtail hoya. And I think my number four favorite would be for sure this guy. Of course, the Clarinervium. Anthurium Clarinervium. This guy is 110. All right guys, I just came out of the store and I did not buy anything. Um, because It's not because I can't find something to buy, it's because I want everything in there. And when I'm in that situation, I'm just, uh, I, I can't decide. And I, I, can't, I can't buy anything. When I buy something, when I go home, I'll be regretting it. I mean, why didn't I get this? Oh, I regret it, so I'd rather not buy at the moment if I really go home and think about it I want something I'll come back after all the prices are um, uh, I mean like they're all very rare plants and obviously it, it's almost like a private collection so uh, they're all amazing plants but the prices are pretty high it's not that they labeled it higher than others it's it is what it is you know these plants are just expensive plants because they're rare so uh, I it's kind of uh, I don't know I'm not ready for really that my most expensive plants are $55 that's a tiny little phil uh, anthurium clarinervium and that already I thought a long long time I thought about two I thought for two weeks to finally order it so it probably going to take me another two weeks to if I'm really going to buy another $100 worth of plants from here. But I love this place. Definitely a hidden gem. Good thing that I didn't buy is it leaves you guys the opportunity to come buy some stuff if you see something you really like. Uh, and thank you to this girl on Instagram. Her name is Welcome to the Jungle. I will link her Instagram down here. And thank you for putting up the awesome Instagram story so that I know about this place. So thousands, thousands of people can watch this place now so they will know that this amazing place has existed. And I hope you guys really enjoyed this video. If you liked it, please give a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed, please subscribe to my channel I post new videos every single week and uh, now we are actually just heading to another nursery since we're down in urban it was an hour drive we are going to a place called OC succulents next and I will post this video next week so stay tuned and I love you all bye